I'm Brad Stark, and I'm joined today with Jeb Harris from Hey, Red Brad. Line How you doing? Good to see you. Great. Explain to us, Jeb, how the Open Series event is different from other events across the country. Okay, so the Open Series, like I, I've said before, it it's just goes away from our conventional way of thinking in the industry uh, where uh, you're going to expensive events and you're finishing the season at an expensive event with a big expensive trip. And so just reverse it. Pick the, your destination that you want to attend at the beginning of the year. Let your parents and your program know that's where you're going. They can get cheaper flights, they can get uh, better hotels, they can get um, all that in order, you know, five, six months ahead of time, and then go back and pick your event producers, whether it be Redline or one of our associate partners, and start earning big credits to get that taken off your, your expense at the end of the year. So that's how it's there. It's completely different. It's more options. It's, it's just a, uh, a different way of doing things. And, I, you know, we don't know how fast it'll take off, but the, the response we're getting right now, is, it's amazing. So. And then you pull in the ranking system again. Yeah, and then weekly you look up the ranking systems and see where your teams ended up. And um, it's coming down the, uh, down the line, and I don't have the information on it, but we will do a true invitational uh, at some point for the Open Series, which will be... A, a completely paid uh, invitational event where if you're ranked in the top three or five of a division you're going to be it's an invitational event and that's the only way you can attend and that's kind of that's kind of down the pipeline but that's where we're headed 